I am at 480 Power Avenue in Buford, Georgia. This is a um, Buford City Schools home. It is a ranch on a basement. Uh, those are two things that I really love about this house. I also love the location. There's no HOA. It's got a huge lot the opportunity to finish a basement. And it is what I will call a true stepless ranch with access outside to the basement. That is very hard to find here in Buford and it's listed at 459,900. Let's go in and take a look and show you the rest of the things that I love about 480 Power Avenue. Isn't that a cool name? Let's go ahead and take a tour of 480 Power Avenue. Just look at this beautiful sit-up porch. All the lighting and fixtures have been completely updated. Uh, this is a two-car carport. And let's go ahead and enter here. This is the kitchen through the carport. So when you're unloading groceries, you can put them right into the refrigerator. Back up so you can see. Brand new granite counters, brand new windows throughout the house. Brand new cabinets. Look at these floorings have been refinished, original hardwood. I believe this house is built in 69, which may seem old, um, however, I can tell you that a lot of people would say that things are much better built that are older. So here's new cabinets into what I call mudroom and laundry. Finished floors. Look at all that cabinet space. There's so many amazing features about this house. It's 1414 upstairs and the mirror image downstairs in the basement. This is all finished. Here's bedroom one. Great size closet. This house would be great for a multi-gen living. If somebody has an elderly parent or something of that sort, um, it would be a great place uh, for you to live together. Um, you might have to finish the bathroom downstairs. But we'll go down there and take a look. This is the master, it has two closets. It's 14, 14 square feet, so it's not a huge house. But like I said, it's big enough. Beautiful glass enclosure, tile floors, all finished, immediately ready for move-in. Here is the other guest bathroom again tile floors look at that beautiful countertop beautiful fixtures all brand new and here is another bedroom This house has plenty of elbow room and so many wonderful features. Let's go down and check out the basement and I'm gonna show you around. So like I said, the basement is unfinished. I'm not gonna sugarcoat that, it is what it is. But look at how high the ceilings are. Most basements have that paneled ceiling and it looks a little cheap. It is plumbed for a bathroom, and there's plenty of space down here. You look at this huge big room in here. This is an amazing space for multi-gen living or an elderly child or whatever the case may be. One of my favorite features is the school district, of course, the ranch, of course, but look at this backyard. Check out the auxiliary shed. But check out the space to do an Easter egg hunt. And again, uh, it could be because we've been having my grandmother 
wheel into our basement that I find it very exciting all the time when I see basement access from the street level. It's not something that you can put in the FMLS. And so um, it's pretty cool whenever I see access to a street level, a below level basement for uh, people who are in a wheelchair. Come and take a peek.